Hi, I'm Dr. Joy Miller, and I am the CEO of Resilience 2022. And yes. we wanted to send you a message of love and of hope. And I'm bringing to you right now, Dr. Edith Eager, who has a special message to everyone. Um, and so I'm going to turn it over to her. You know, there is no such thing in my book as a problem. There is a challenge. There is no crisis. There is a transition. And so I want to tell you that what I'm going to tell you is what I lived. And I was put in a place when I never knew what's going to happen next. And I think you may be experiencing the same thing. And I want you to know that I never gave up hope. I never ever told of getting out of here uh, as a corpse, as I was told. So today I'm here Hopefully, I can be a guide to you and recognize that all the power you have inside you. And I hope you can think hopefully and see what I said in Auschwitz. If I survive today, then tomorrow I'll be free. And you know, tomorrow, tomorrow became my wonderful ally. And I hope that you can also find the strength within you because the more you suffer, I know you're going to become stronger for it. And so I want to wish you a life of joy and love and passion and not to allow anything to get to you that is not really empowering to you. So I hope that you can empower yourself every morning. You look in the mirror and find a hope, hope in hopelessness. And I know that this is temporary and you can survive it. So why don't you gonna repeat after me to say, I don't like it, it's inconvenient and it's temporary and I can survive it. Not the yes, but, yes, and. And I'm going to really look this as a challenge and it's going to be hopefully a, a way to somehow learn to grow and the suffering will make me even a better guide to another person. And all we have was each other really now. And I hope that you can really empower each other with your differences. I love you, send you all my love and good luck. Thank you, Dr. Eager. And we thank you for taking your time and sending this message of hope. And I also want to add that we are keeping you all in our prayers and in our thoughts. And as Edith said, we know that you will be strong and we will keep you in our hearts. Thank you, thank you so much. You're the most beautiful person I ever met in my life. So I'm so happy to do this with you. God Thank bless you. you. Same to you. And I love you and, and everyone. Thank you for listening. Thank you.